to Feature Friday here at Oil Life. I'm Emily. I'm Sarah. And we're going to be talking today about taking oils internally. Yes. Which we know is a big topic for a lot of people. A lot of people love it, do it all the time. Some people are nervous about it <laughs> and have no idea how to do it. So we're going to be talking about that. Um, good so ways we're to also, get started. Yeah, good ways to get started and um, understand how it works. For sure. um, so we are doing a giveaway today. We're going to be doing a $5 off. $50. Uh -huh. um, we're going to be doing that as a coupon code, so make sure that you are commenting um, below, and that and will run for 24 hours. Oh yeah, share. Comment and share our post, and you'll be entered to win five dollars off of fifty. Five dollars off a of purchase of fifty. Yes. Yeah. Yep. So we like shares. So make sure you're you sharing. Um, give us thumbs up too, because that makes us feel good. <laughs> um, but yeah, so the first question I'm going to ask you today is, um, what oils do you take internally? So just share in the comments. It can be one. It can be three. Just share. Um, in one comment, you know, kind of what are the oils that you normally take internally, if you do at all. Um, yeah, and then we're going to get started with why vegetarian capsules? Yeah, so why should we use vegetarian capsules over, you know, putting them in your water or putting them under your tongue? You know, what's what's the difference, right? Mm -hmm. That's kind of one thing why people always ask, you know, what's, what's the point? Why should I take it in a capsule? Right. Um, I think one of the main reasons is it takes away the taste because oils can be really strong tasting they're and you not, want those benefits. They're not all lovely taste. Yes, they're not all lovely to taste. So it takes away that really, really strong taste. Yeah. Um, you're able to dilute it a little bit as well as... Um, Go straight to the body yes. system that you're needing it to affect. Exactly. So it's going to be quicker. Yeah, because you're going to take go. it internally. It's going to dissolve. It's going to go right into the bloodstream um, versus topical application with... Which is pretty fast as well, but may take a little bit longer. Definitely. So we're going to talk about um, some safety that goes with um, taking vegetarian capsules yes. internally. Um, so we want to make sure that they're the highest grade mm -hmm. oils. So pure therapeutic yeah. grade. Yeah. Certified pure therapeutic grade. Yes. Um, you can <laughs> notice that on the bottle. If you look at um, whatever company bottle you're using, it'll say on the bottle if it's therapeutic yep. grade. Um, and it'll also say on the bottle if you can take it internally as well. So make sure you're reading the labels of your bottles. Um, also make sure you're talking to a healthcare professional for sure. if you're using the oils for a specific yes. element of sorts. Um, you can also turn to our trusty Essential Life books. Resource yes. guides, right? Tons so let's stuff. talk about a little bit about what's in here and how that helps you inside. Right. Do we want to start with the Let's start mini with book? The, the mini books. We've got our quick reference guide here. If you guys visit us at convention, you might have gotten one of these for free. They're the best. Um, so we actually sell these, and these are perfect for on the go or for giving to someone or for having in your purse, things like that. Um, and the nice thing about this is if you open it up, it will have all sorts of ailments and things like that. Uh, so say you're looking to, let's see, what should we do? Um, you have poison ivy. You can see it'll have an internal, um, the blue circle right here. It'll show how you, which oils you can take internally. So if you look on this page, there's tons of blue everywhere, right? Those are the oils and it'll tell you, you know, what to take internally for what. Um, hopefully that made sense. Yeah, um. <laughs> yeah. so there's indicators in all three of the books, and I think they're the same indicator across the books. Obviously, yes. these are all part of the Essential Life family, um, so that makes it very easy because all of the indicators the and content is the same. For sure, you're going to look for that blue circle. It's got a little glass, like a glass you would drink, and that mm -hmm. shows which ones you should take internally. Or so. could take internally, yeah. Yes. For sure. So um, now we're going to talk more specifically about what the vegetarian capsule looks like, yes. right? So yes. we have a bottle here. We actually sell these at Oil Life. Um, the link is in our description if you're interested in buying some. This is 250 count. So we're going to pull one of these out. You want Thank you. Thank you. This is what they look like. So you can actually just pull these apart. They're really easy to open. Uh, so there will be a big half and there will be a small half. So Basically how it works is the skinny bottom half is the one that holds the oils. Put the oils in this one. The big one. And then the smaller one that's a little bit bigger, that's going to be your cap. So you'll just put it right on top, close it up, and that's how you'll take it. Yeah, so this one easy. is skinnier and taller, and this one's wider and shorter. Right. So the wider and shorter one's the cap. Yes. It goes on top. So that allows for you to put more oils right yeah this one because there's it's more capacity yeah. in here more capacity so let's talk about a little bit about that we won't fill it up right now but 
we're going to talk about um, how to fill it. Best way to go. Yes. Yeah. So you could just take the bottle. We're just going to grab this one real quick. Directly drop um, it. And drop it if you're that skilled. But how many of us are that skilled? Raise your hands. No. No. I mean, you can give us a thumbs up if you are that skilled. We're not. So what we would suggest is purchasing um, our droppers. Yes. Um, this one right here is a five mil size. I know that this bottle's 15, but this size right here is five mil. Um, the dropper itself is a little shorter. We also sell them for 15 mil, milliliter. Um, so you'll get yourself some droppers. And then, let's see if we can show the audience. You'll wanna just pop the top off of the oil bottle. We have this um, awesome little tool here that Thank we sell you. here. They come in all these colors. I, I know, we them. have fancy colors. So I don't know if you can see that. It matches my shirt today. Cute. Um, <laughs> so you would just stick the dropper in the bottle, fill it up. I'm just gonna go ahead and do it. I'm only just doing a little bit. Where did my yeah, veggie capsule? Got it. And then you can just drop it straight in there. I'm still not, I'm still shaky guys. So see, I really need the dropper. Yeah, for real. Okay. <laughs> So, um, best practices is what, one to two drops? One to two drops is the best, um, and if you want to try doing, you know, one oil, two different oils, different Yeah, so ones. you can make a blend in your capsule. Use a blend that's pre-made. And then what should we also do? We should dilute it, right? We should dilute it, definitely. So, we did bring some olive oil. Um, this is just store-bought olive oil. It's nothing fancy. Uh, so you do want to fill the rest of it up with olive oil to properly dilute it. Yeah, so that's as simple as that. I'm gonna put the cap on it. So we just did this right here for show, but another thing to remember is that these are meant to dissolve really, really quickly. Quick. Mm -hmm. So you'll want to um, take it immediately after filling it. Definitely. And especially if you're using hot oils, which are typically the oils that you're gonna want to put in your veggie caps versus others. So let's talk about that for a second. Definitely. So we have some oils here. The one that I just used um, is, lemon, is lemongrass. Um, and a funny story about this. So when I started taking oils internally, um, I, I, lemon makes me sick. I can't drink lemon okay. at all, period. So I was like, well, I'll try lemon essential oil and see if it's better than straight up lemon. And it wasn't, so okay. like bothered me. <laughs> so I was like, well, I really love lemongrass. I love to cook with lemongrass, love the smell, like I'll try it. So at first I was like, oh, this tastes really good. Like I can stomach it. Yeah. Well then um, it's, a hot, it's a hotter oil. And so I started noticing my lips were a little oh, puffy, or tingly, tingly, like a little burnt. <laughs> and so I was like, oh, maybe I shouldn't take that with water anymore. So lemongrass would be a great one to take in a capsule. Definitely. Number one, to bypass that odd, odd taste, perhaps. Maybe the, the but also sensation. that it, it could burn your yes. mouth um, Not great. or your digestive tract. Okay. So, um, and another one that's a great example for that, that a lot of people take is oregano. Again, it's a hot oil. So you're not gonna wanna put it straight into your water, yeah. but veggie cap is the way to go. Definitely. Um, and then like you said, also it's great for blending um, different oils. So that way you're not necessarily having to put a bunch of um, oil in your water. Yeah, you don't have to. Um, I think probably for that, like hot oils, and then probably if you just don't like the taste of oils, that's the best reason to take it in a bit. For sure. Um, and then we have over here, covered them up a little bit, um, some favorite oils Definitely. that every, most everyone likes the everyone loves these. We've got taste of or smell of. We've got peppermint, we've got lemon, we've got grapefruit, uh, and I think these are like top ones to take in your water. Yeah. Um, but they're really easy to take in a, in a capsule as well, so it just kind of depends what you prefer. Yeah, so we have these water bottles here. These are my fave. Yeah, I love talking about these. So we just want to make so sure we cute. use glass yep. or glass or steel. Stainless steel, yep. Um, with our oils to take them internally with water. For sure. um, so let us know in the comments below um, what kind of advice that you would give to someone who's just starting out taking um, essential oils internally, like my story. Um, I kind of made a mistake, so we've all learned things. So share in the comments below. Um, some things that you've learned that you would um, suggest to people who are just starting out and taking um, oils for the first time internally. Also, if you're new to taking oils internally, or you're a little nervous about it, share in the comments below what, what you're kind of nervous about, your concerns about taking them internally, and maybe some of our community members can help you out and answer those questions for you. Um, what's next? That might be all that we have to talk about today. That should we recap just a little bit? Yeah, let's just do a quick, quick overview. 
So uh, if you are looking to take oils internally, a good place to start is figure out which oils are going to be best for that. They do have that written right on the bottle. The therapeutic grade. Uh, so yep, they do have to be therapeutic grade and make sure that they are okay for internal consumption. And again, yeah. it says it right on the bottle. So look at your bottles um, and consult a, a reference guide. A re reference guide if you're Consult know. a physician if needed. Always remember that. Definitely. Um, and all three of our essential life um, guides yeah. will have that same information where you can see, should I be taking this internally? And they'll also let you know, here's the best thing to take it for if right. you are trying to heal a certain thing. So, And then we want to make sure that we dilute it. Olive mm -hmm. oil is probably the best carry oil that you, know, you always take internally when you're cooking and things. So olive oil is a great one to dilute in your vegetarian capsules. Um, and take them quick after because yeah. they will dissolve. So make dissolve. sure you take them I'm pretty quick after you make them. After you fill them. Definitely. Yeah, so that's all for today. Um, yes. Make sure that you're answering those two questions that we shared. You know, advice you'd give to someone um, who's taking them for the first time. What are kind of your concerns about taking them? Um, what oils do you take internally? Make sure you're commenting, sharing, liking so that we can give away $5 off a $50 purchase. Purchase. Yes. Um, so make sure you're doing that. And then also make sure that you are um, subscribe to our newsletter and um, we can throw a link in the description for that um, we are ramping up the, for the holiday season so you won't want to miss out on all the things that we have coming down the pipeline for the holidays so again make sure you're signed up um, for our newsletter and following us on all our social platforms and we can't wait to see you um, on Tuesday for sure see you later